Welcome to Movement Monday. This is Austin Martin, first one of the series. We're going to get started with some bent over rows today. One of my favorite exercises to teach. A lot of people get it wrong, but it's a really great exercise for you. It's a back movement, a little bit of biceps. Uh, we got to make sure we get this one right, because if you go too heavy, it might not be as effective. It can also hurt you. So we're going to make sure they're doing this right. Alright, step one with the barbell bent over row. It's going to be a hinge at the hips once we have this bar in our hand. We're going to hinge here. Back is going to stay nice and straight, tight, and we're going to have a slight bend in the knees. Alright, we've got to remember those two points. So when we pick this up, come in here, soft knees, hinge at the hips right here. Back is going to be almost parallel to the ground a little bit higher. That's step number one. Step number two, once we're hinged over, in this position, back tight, we're pulling. Think about pulling with your elbows and taking this bar into your midsection. Just right there. Lead with the elbow, pull into the stomach there. Point number three, one thing that we want to make sure we get right. When we're pulling with elbows, we also want to make sure that the shoulders come back as well. Just like that. If we pull with just the elbows and don't think about retracting the shoulders and our shoulder blades, our shoulders are going to stay here and we're just going to pull with the elbows. We want to make sure that everything comes back together all in one simultaneous motion. Last important note, when we do this bent over row, we want to make sure that our elbows stay in nice and tight into our body and that they don't flare out like this. What happens here when they flare out is we start to use our shoulders instead of our back. So right here, keep the elbows in tight, using that back, feel it working, pulling everything together just like that. 